This video will discuss about assist in defense. First of all, why do we need assist in defense? For the most common answer will be because some character's offensive ability is too good. If the onboard defender unable to react in time, he will just shoot for a wide open or attack the basket. In order to reduce this kind of situation happen, we have to play as a team and stop them from scoring. Today we are using S Ryoji as he is one of the good defensive player. Here is the best example. Monkey was blocked and Rukawati a crossover to the right. Then Ryoji needs to assist Monkey, then he switched immediately. Then Rukawa has passed the ball to Sento. Then the Monkey defense concept is good. He is also immediately switched to defense Sento. Until we are able to reposition ourselves, then we switch back to our target. And ends with a nice block from me. <laughs> it just happened very fast. A correct concept teammate will directly make a decision rather those keep spamming man to man. Remember, don't be the one who is yelling. Most of us don't like this way. If we don't like, don't be the one who the others hate the most. If we observe carefully the positioning of Ryoji, while Rukawa doing crossover, Ryoji has positioned himself to defend his fade away and not missing out the Sento. This can be happen when Sento is not creating sufficient space for his team. If there is no 3-pointer, Ryoji actually can position himself like this. This kind of positioning can back up teammate if they fall down and not letting the shooters create much space. This is one of the Ryoji positioning technique. The more we play, the better defensive concept we are. Seeing Ryoji is the character that wins with defense. That's why a good defensive character is the most important piece for some formation, especially to support strong offensive player. Rugawa did a good V-shape fade away after creating so much space. This is a good one. But Ryoji and Monkey are never give up to defense. That is the spirit. How can we give up like that? This is another good trick for Monkey. Only pass the ball to the Monkey after he leaped forward when the start of a possession. Then he can do a fast dunk and the center yet to be in position. Look at Ryoji and Monkey positioning. It means we not really need to keep following our targets. We just remain a good distance while they are doing crossover. If they are trying to score, then we will cross the distance. And Monkey did a nice deal. This is solo queue match. We just met for the first time and we coordinated well. This is all because our concept is the same. And we are falling in love to each other. This is the moment that I mentioned from my previous video. But true love is really hard to find. Ah, <laughs> just kidding guys. This monkey just did another leap dunk. Nice one. For both defensive and offensive concept, he is good enough. Here, Ryoji can react in time and provide heavy interference. But too bad, Sento made that shot. Sento fade away can be very annoying if you guess wrongly. Then he will have a good shooting opportunity. If you are able to follow him, then he will just pass the ball to reset the play call. This is the reason Sento is a top tier character. He can score, he can pass, and he can block. All got talents to support him. When Ryoji's angle was broken, Jun did a good block, and Monkey are looking for the floor ball. Then he scored by another 2 point layout. From here, we can see the rival team coordination is very bad. No one is allocated to block Monkey's second point layup. No good. Monkey is preventing Rukawa's fade away. Then I preventing Rukawa doing hesitation move and follow him back to the basket for blocking second point. And another good block from Jun. The reasons why Ryoji team can do so well in defense all because of everyone knows what is their duty. Center is going to block the first point, then the Ombo defenders and others will block the second point. There is no misunderstanding. If the other one is mispositioned, they will just do their best to fill the gap and never letting them to defend alone. When Monkey heard my shouting, he immediately covered me but he blocked at the wrong timing. Still give him a light. This is what I mentioned just now. Help your teammate out if their anger are broken. It is impossible to stand out in time to block that shot that need you. After we did a passing mistake, all of us were out of position. But Monkey and Ryoji realized it is better to switch than they immediately react 
And I miss my Audi. No good, no good. But luckily, forced him to make a sing mistake. We have taken back the possession. Everyone in the blue team is doing good job here. They want to win. They think about how to help out each other and try their best. This is why I found competitive game is so fun to play. Just for this kind of moment. Everyone not thinking other things. Just do everything they can. I thought it was a wide open. But too bad. Sandro did the technique I am mentioning. Just dash toward your target if you are too far away. Light interference is better than none. Another one. If you think your teammate is going to be blocked, what should we do? I think Apui repeated a lot of times. Going to the opposite direction of the block and predict the location of the floor ball. And Ryoji picked up another good hustle ball. I never thought Monkey and I are coordinated that well for the first time we met. Monkey used his back to defense first point Sento fake away. Then immediately positioned himself to the paint area if Sento is going for a layout. Then Ryoji used his dash and blind block to close the distance and Sento missed another shot. So what we have seen so far? There is four major concepts that must be embedded in our mind. The first one is, if your teammate's anger is broken, immediately help him to defend his target. At least provide some interference. When he climb up, slowly switch back to on target. Do not rush. If not, it is very easy to miss position again. And second one is, automatically switch target if things gone bad. Who is closer to the target? defend him first. We have to switch our mind immediately. The third one is, try our best to defend even if it looks hopeless. We never gain experience and improve if we are not trying at all. The fourth one is, do not blame your teammate or spamming man to man, except they are making the same mistakes again and again. Then we just remind them one time is sufficient. Be careful to use man to man and take care of rebounds message. For the first message, some character has lack of defensive talent. They can't solo defend character like Kenji, Sento or Rukawa because they will easily fall down or not enough speed to follow them. The worst case is there is a huge screen to block his way and the screen is your target and you are not assisting him but to blame him. No good, no good. This is definitely not helping the situation at all. That will cause bad chemistry in the team. Here, after I touch their bubble, we are out of position again. From the distance, Monkey is unable to follow back Rukawa. So Ryuji make a decision and use his dash and blind block again. Another miss from the rival team, but ends with Akaki Audi. For the second message, it hurts the center's feeling. Do you think they don't want to grab the rebound? Just because their rival center has much better in rebounding abilities or even in strength. Not that the one is unable to. The one with higher strength will push him to corner. The one with higher rebounding and jump stats can just grab the rebound above their head. Please think it through before speaking it out. This is the one of the best opportunity for Ryoji Daddy to use his ulti. Monkey is blocking Rukawa way and Rukawa flinched for a while. At this moment, still their bubble and will be a success one. This is how should it be in the higher rank. Just because my teammates share the same defensive concept as me. If not, we will not coordinate that well. There is no me in a team game. If we insist to play in selfish way, that will reflect in your winning rate too. If you enjoy the content, please hit the like button and subscribe my channel. Thank you guys. I will be back.